Hello everyone, I'm Jessica Morales. We are celebrating OTC's golden anniversary with a look at a few of the spotlight on new technology winners awarded by OTC. This year, more than a dozen companies are being recognized. We had the opportunity to speak with a few of them. Here's a compilation of our discussions. This technology has been in development about six to seven years. We started in 2012 with our first kind of qualification engineering and development. And we've been through three phases of development, A, B, and C, with A, kind of the initial engineering in 2012. Then we worked on qualification of components and the basic uh, building blocks. And then 2018 is when we brought it all together and did full-scale qualification. So it's about a six-year period, uh, including uh, the participation of some major operators as well as Demo 2000, which is a Norwegian-funded uh, support service for qualification. Weatherford has worked on the RFID-based completion systems for the last decade. Uh, it's been an evolutionary process for us, and we've taken all the lessons learned that we've had over the last 10 years, and we combined it into a single, single-trip completion system. It's a game-changing technology for our customers. Uh, we like to call it a, a revolutionary concept, but using evolutionary technology. Concert Well Testing Live Performance is a information-centric ecosystem. In other words, it brings collaboration, teamwork and communication uh, and accessibility to all users across the operation as well as no matter what location they're in. So it gives them a digital uh, view of the entire well testing operation and this includes uh, well testing operations as well as clean, clean up and flow back operations. It's uh, a large amount of uh, ruggedized tablets along with wearable technology, wireless sensors, and video cameras. So it, it brings down the uh, risk of an operation, allowing the operator to really look at reservoir potential. One of the beauties of the RFID actuation systems uh, is that it allows your tools to be pressure insensitive as well as multi-cycle when you run them in the hull. So now you can, you can circulate as many times as you want. You can circulate off bottom the whole trip in the well. You can test your tubing as many times as you want. You can open and close ball valves, sliding sleeves. You can test your safety valves anytime you want while you're tripping in the well. Each individual tool in the, in the single trip completion system can be operated independently discreetly from each other. So now you can open and close a ball valve at any time. You can open the ball valve at a discrete time in the well. You can close it later, pressure test your tubing, reopen the ball valve again. It's a unique technology that, we only, that only Weatherford has. Simply put, a subsea flow meter is a key building block of the digital foundation on subsea wells. It provides flow rate data that is used by our customers to refine their reservoir models and enables them to take action to optimize reservoir management as well as maximize productivity from their wells. Traditionally, operators have been very concerned with the reliability of multi-phase flow meters, and as a result, package them into very big, expensive, retrievable flow control modules on subsea Christmas trees. Addition of these flow control modules is a band-aid solution that added a lot of weight, complexity, and cost to the subsea trees. It did not really address the root cause of the problem. The VX Omni subsea multi-phase flow meter was our answer to that. With a mean time between failure of over 200 years, it offers a step change in reliability performance. This is comparable to the reliability performance of satellites that we put in space. Right? This, was, this was driven by a step change in the product architecture that resulted in a 66% reduction in the part count and over 30% reduction in weight and cost. This enabled us to package these in a much more capital efficient way onto our subsea Christmas trees. Moreover, these meters can now be delivered 50% faster, empowering our customers with data that they can use to uh, reuse to effectively manage their reservoirs. The industry has been challenged uh, to develop these, these reservoirs back to existing hosts. Subsea tiebacks have become very, very a powerful tool to, to make good returns as long as you've got the economical solution. Trying to extend those tiebacks, so to make them longer, this is a technology that allows you to pig from the seabed to the platform. So this subsea automatic pig launcher uh, will, will eventually eliminate a second flow line where typically you'd have two to bring the pig from the, the platform around back to the platform. Here you can uh, send it from subsea to the platform, eliminate a line. Also gives you opportunities to do more regular maintenance and cleaning of the line to help with flow assurance. 
Uh, we're not having to mobilize vessels and ROVs and other type of kit that can be expensive in the long term. We also see unmanned platforms is a an area where this technology could be uh, utilized as platforms typically have pig launchers receivers that have uh, manual intervention. Here you can uh, have it remotely controlled uh, and, and be able to pig from the platform back without uh, personnel on the vessel. It's a real honor for the entire team to be recognized at a major industry platform like OTC. The Spotlight on New Technology Award is a true testament of the hard work of the multidisciplinary team involved in the development of this breakthrough technology. We truly stretch the technology boundaries to create this unique, simple, reliable, digitally enabled multi-phase flow meter solution for all applications. I would like to thank the team that is involved in the development and I would also like to thank our customers for their constant feedback and the overwhelming response they have given with adoption of this technology.